Hey guys, what's up? It's me, The Weekend Warrior, and it looks like this is going to be the first episode on my new channel. Every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I'm going to be uploading a game plan on the PC, and during the weekend, when I get my HCP VR, I'll be uploading something on Xbox, maybe Call of Duty, maybe maybe I'll do a Half-Life 2 playthrough, who knows, I'll be doing a bunch of stuff on the Xbox, but right now we're playing Pokemon Emerald on the PC, I'm using Visual Boy Advance as my emulator. This game came out in 2005. It was probably one of the best games in the Pokemon series, in my opinion. And I'm going to be playing it. And the inter Okay, whatever. I don't really care about that. All right, let's go to options. I'm just going to make the tech speed really fast because I hate it when it's really um, low. I know. I don't care. Shut up. Okay. We're going to start off with a new game. I'm going to speed up through this until Professor Bitch shuts up. Yep, we know. You have a low tad. Low tads suck, dude. Um, I am a boy because I'm not a transvestite. My name will be Connor, I guess. I'll get. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> <coughs> All right. Um, O N N O R. That's how you spell my name in real life, too. Yep. Shut up. Shut up. I know. I'm in Little Root. Shut up. Shut up. All right. This this game probably starts off with the most original cutscene to start off with. I mean, you're in a you're in a loading truck, which is pretty cool, and um, so. Then you get chipped off, I guess, on the uh, Underground Railroad. No. Then your mom comes out. Mom, Connor, we're tired. Oh, blah, blah. I sped it up by accident. It must be tiring ri riding with our things in the moving truck. Well, this is Little Root Town. How do you like it? This is our new home. It has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? And you get your own room, Connor. Let's go inside. Sweet. Milf, let me inside. See, Connor, isn't it nice in here, too? They move us Pokemon, do all the work of moving in us in and cleaning up after. That was my ankle, if you could hear that. This is so convenient. Connor, your room is upstairs. Go check it out, dear. Dad bought you a new clock to mark your our move here. Don't forget to set it. I will. No, I won't. Just kidding. There's a clock. Clock is stopped. Better set and set it. Right now, it is 323. Um, come on. It's about... I don't, I don't know. Wait, I'm wrong. Right there, I guess. Sure, that's the correct time. I woke up about two hours earlier today, so, yeah. Good, everything's put away neatly. They finished moving everything in the downstairs, too. That was really fucking quick. Pokemon movers are so convenient. <laughs> Lazy ass bitch. Oh, you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. Let's see what's on my desk. Connor flipped up with a notebook. Adventure rule number one, open the menu to start. Adventure rule number two, record your progress with save. The remaining pages are blank. That's a really informative book. Um, in almost every Pokemon shit, in almost every Pokemon, um, in the computer, there's always a potion sort of hidden. In Pokemon Heart Gold and Gold and Silver, there wasn't actually, which is kind of weird. But this is uh, one of the ones that had the potion in it. Oh, Connor, Connor, quick, come quickly. Why'd you say quick and then come quickly? Look, it's Petalburg Gym. Maybe Dad will be on. Sweet. We bought, uh, brought you this report from the, um, in front of Petalburg Gym. Oh, it's over. That was really quick. I think Dad was on, but we missed him. Too bad. Oh, yes, one of Dad's friends lives in town. Professor Bitch, Birch, Bitch, yeah, it's Bitch, is his name. He lives right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. Well, since she's telling us, I might as well. Okay, let's go next door. Don't have running shoes, so I'm just going to speed up. Up, oh, up, oh, bitch noticed me. Oh, hello, and you are Ellipsis, Ellipsis, Ellipsis. Oh, you're Connor, our new next door neighbor. Hi, we have a daughter about the same age as you, and we gon' fuck. Our daughter was excited about making a new friend. Our daughter is upstairs, I think. Oh, she's already let me in the bedroom. Shit. What's in this Pokeball? Oh, God. Spotted me taking a Pokeball. Huh? Who? Who are you? Elli Why are there so many ellipses? Oh, you're Connor, so you're moving with us today. Um, I'm May. Glad to meet you. I I have this dream of becoming friends with Pokemon all over the world. I, I heard about you, Connor, from my dad, Professor Birch. She's really stuttering. I guess she really likes me. She's wet, probably, already. I was hoping that uh, you would be nice, Connor, and that we could be friends. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I, I met you, Connor. <laughs> That's really creepy. 
Oh no, I forgot. I was supposed to help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. Connor, I'll catch you later. Why are you going to your computer if you're going to catch... You, you just said you were going to go help your dad catch Pokemon. Why are you on the computer? Makes no sense. What does your clock say? I want to know. Oh, same as mine. Okay. Um, I guess now we're qualified to get... Yep. This bitch ain't going to stop us. There's scary Pokemon outside. I can hear their cries. I want to go see what's going on, but I don't have any Pokemon. Can you see what's going? What's happening for me? Well, I don't really have any Pokemon either, so... Uh, help me! Professor Bitch is being chased by the weakest Pokemon in the game, is Zigzagoon. Hello, you over there. Please, help! In my bag, there's a Pokeball. Yes, we get to steal one of his Pokemon. <clears throat> um, I guess we will steal Mudkip. I guess I choose this Pokemon. Um, I'm going to name my Mudkip when I get to name him. I'll probably name him, hmm, name him Brody. <laughs> no, no clever nicknames, sorry. Professor Bitch, woo, I was in the tall grass studying why a Pokemon when I was jumped. You saved me. Thanks a lot. Oh, hi, you're Connor. This is not the place to chat, so come by my Pokemon lab later, okay? That was quick, and I guess it's later. So, Connor, I've heard so much about you from your father. I've heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. But, uh, but the way you battled earlier, you pulled it off with a blomp? A, a plum? I don't know what that means. I guess you are uh, you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Oh, yes. As a, Thanks for rescuing me. I'd like you to have this Pokemon you used earlier. Connor received the Mudkip. And it will, uh, while you're at it, why not give a nickname? So fuck yeah, I want to give a nickname. Brody. Wait, what's my... I can't remember what my select key is. I'll probably... I'll check that up when I'm done. B-R-O-D-Y. Brody. If you work at Pokemon and gain experience, I think you'll make an extremely good trainer. My kid May is also studying Pokemon while helping me out. Uh, actually, she's sitting at the computer right now, being a fat bitch, probably on Facebook or Tumblr or some shit. Connor, don't you think it might be a good idea to go see May? Since you're telling me to go see May pretty much, just inadvertently. I guess I'll go see May. Great, May should be happy too. To get May to teach you what it means to be a trainer. What you gotta say? What you gotta say? Professor Bitch is studying the habitats and distribution of Pokemon. The professor enjoys May's help too. There's a lot to love. Uh, blah, blah, whatever, I don't care. Speed this shit up because it's too slow. What the what the fuck? What the fuck? Where's May? Alright. I guess we're gonna go into the wild now. What do you wanna say? Wild Pokemon will jump okay, I know. Ooh, excuse me, I just had a burp. Oh, oh. Poochie, I know. I will probably catch you later. Let's get some experience. Speed this up, cause it's too slow. Boom. You dead, boy. If Pokemon get tired, take them to a Pokemon Center. There's a Pokemon Center in Old Old Ale Town right by, close by, which is literally like five steps from this tall grass. But I get fucking caught up in the tall fucking grass. Brody used Tackle. Brody used it again to a KO, bitch. And I grew to level six. And I learned Mud Slap. We are so on our way to being a Pokemon League champion. Um, Actually, we don't really need to heal up. I don't know why I came to this Pokemon Center. <sighs> Hi, working Pokemon marketing. You're gonna give me a potion, I know. Yep, promotional item. Have a promotional blowjob. That'd probably get me to buy more stuff as a Pokemon. But you're ugly and you have curly hair. That's like looks like my grandmother's hair. Let's see. The Pokemon found on Rune Route 103 include. She's looking at her Pokedex. Oh hi Connor. Oh, I see my dad gave you a Pokemon as a gift. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of what it's being a trainer is like. Actually, one thing you missed is when I look at you, you make me battle. I guess you didn't really miss that, but whatever. I talked to you instead. You have that. It's going down. I probably should not have, yeah. A crit and it did, like, nothing. Uh, I'm going to have to use my potion soon. Uh, yep, you missed. Suck a dick. And you missed again. <laughs> Two times in a fucking row, you missed. Probably because of my mud slap. Player defeated Trainer May. Give me money. Give me money. Yes, 300 bucks. Jesus Christ, imagine if there was Pokemon in, in uh, fucking the real world. Just getting $300 from, like, 
for making animals pit against each other. It's kind of like dog fighting, but not really. I think I know what my dad has an eye out for, you know. I mean, you just got that Pokemon, but it already likes you. You might be able to befriend any kind of Pokemon easily. Well, it's time to head back to the lab. Okay, let's go back to the lab. Actually, let's heal up. Actually, I don't need to heal up. I'm going to get healed up. I'm going to go back to the lab. Boom. Yo, yo. Let's get back to the lab. Oh, hi, Connor. I heard you beat May on your first try. That's excellent. May's been helping me with my research for a long time. Then why is her fucking Pokemon only a level 6? May has an extensive history as a tra- she Her Pokemon's only level 6. How can she have an extensive history with it? Here, Connor. I ordered you for my research, but I think you should have this Pokedex. Sweet. I know I received the Pokedex. <clears throat> the Pokedex is a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokemon you meet or catch. My kid May goes everywhere with it. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokemon and records it in a... D- uh, what the fuck? No one catches a rare Pokemon here. Seriously, her Pokemon's only level 6, and I just raped it. Oh, wow, Connor, you've got a Pokedex, too. That's great, just like me. I've gotten some for you, too. Yes, Pokeballs! May just gave me my balls. Sweet. It's fun if you can get a lot of Pokemon. I'm going to look all over the place because I want different Pokemon. If I find any cute Pokemon, I'll catch them with Pokeballs. Why does she have balls? Okay, guys, it's like almost 12 minutes, so I think I'm going to cut up. Wait, wait, Connor. Connor, Connor, did you introduce yourself to Professor Bitch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon. You got from Professor Bitch. How nice. Your father's child, after all. Or, all right. You look together. You look good together with Pokemon. Here, honey, if you're going out on an adventure, wear these running shoes. They'll put a zip in your step. Yeah, running shoes. I wish it was like heart gold where I could just press a button and um, and run the entire way without having to hold down the B button. I'm pretty sure this is the only shoes in the entire fucking universe that come with goddamn instructions. <laughs> Press the B button while wearing these running shoes to run extra fast. Slip on these running shoes and race in the great outdoors. Why are there so many fucking ellipses? To think that you have your very own Pokemon now. Your father will be overjoyed. But please be careful. If anything happens, you can come home. Go on and go get them, honey. Go back inside and make me a sandwich, bitch. All right. Um, this is where we're going to end the episode right here. So I want to thank you guys for watching. It's been really good. Um doing this first episode so if you liked it like it if it's your favorite video ever favorite it and share it on facebook with all your nerdy friends and all that stuff because it's only pokemon no one's gonna really notice it if you just share it with cool friends so um thanks for watching i'll see you guys later